JDNT Advisor and Creo Parametric 9.0 provides enhanced support to the detailing standards, as well as improved usability when creating dimensions for tolerance features. While I am creating this new hole feature, I can see that there is a dimension missing in the model for completing the definition. Now instead of coming back to Creo and recreating this missing dimension manually, I can choose to automatically create this from the feature definition and save me some time. New details tab was also added to the tolerance definition. This tab accommodates the required ISO GPS modifiers, ASME symbols, and other values that you might need to input. The different fields become available only in applicable situations, and you can also learn more about them using the enhanced tooltips. To make your work more efficient, when selecting an annotation from the graphics area, you will now see that the corresponding feature will also get selected in the feature tree, which will save you time to find it when you need to edit its properties. Here I would like to add additional ISO GPS filters and characteristics. While typing filter values, GDNT Advisor will highlight me cases of syntax errors and will allow me to make sure that I'm correctly defining the definition per the standards. Other characteristics also have logic built into them. When I select a specific association, only relevant parameters will be available, so I can make sure that I'm correctly defining my GDNT.